Hi, guys. Welcome back to Isis Chan. Are you struggling with your iPad showing as unavailable? When your iPad shows unavailable, it usually indicates that the device has been disabled due to incorrect passcode attempts. To fix the iPad unavailable issue, you can enter the passcode later. When the countdown is over, enter the right passcode. You can also try the following three methods to open your locked Apple devices. Now, let's get started. Method 1. Fix iPad unavailable with EaseUS Mobi Unlock. EaseUS Mobi Unlock is a desktop software designed to unlock iPhone or iPad without a passcode, Face ID, or Touch ID. Download and install it from the link in the description below. Connect your iPad to your computer with a compatible USB cable. Run EaseUS Mobi Unlock and select Unlock Screen Passcode from the home page. Then, click Start to proceed. Follow the instruction to put your iPad into the recovery mode. Check your device model and click Next to download the latest version of firmware for your device. Click Unlock Now and wait for the tool to remove the unavailable screen. Method 2. Fix iPad unavailable with iTunes or Finder. iTunes or Finder is the official tool that helps fix the iPad unavailable screen or the iPad disabled issue. To use this method, connect your iPad to the computer and launch iTunes. If you use Mac, open Finder. Then, put your iPad into the recovery mode. For iPads with a home button, press and hold both the home and the top button simultaneously until you see the recovery mode screen four iPads without a home button. Step one, press and release the volume up button. Step two, press and release the volume down button. Step three, press and hold the top button until the device enters recovery mode. Once in recovery mode, a window will appear saying, there is a problem with the iPad that requires it to be updated or restored. Choose restore to update and restore. Then the unavailable screen will be removed. You can set up your iPad again as a new device. Method 3. Fix iPad unavailable without a computer. If you don't have a computer by your side, if your iPad is running iPadOS 15.2 or later, if your iPad is connected to the internet, if you turned on Find My before the iPad got locked, if you still remember the Apple ID account used on the device, you can reset your iPad directly from the lock screen. Step 1. After you enter the wrong passcode several times, you will see the Erase iPad button at the bottom of the screen. Tap on it. Step 2. Tap Erase iPad again to confirm the action. Step 3. Enter your Apple ID password to verify your identity. Then, your iPad will be erased. You can set it up again and set a new passcode. That's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tips. Have any questions? Drop them in the comments below.